On Saturday at 2 p.m., while most Oxfordians were sipping cocktails in the Grove, Off Square Books was holding a book signing with Wayne Simmons, an author and painter who I was told went to Ole Miss. So you were a student here at Ole Miss? I was. And this was from 1965 to 1970. Simmons' road to authorship was not typical. At 63, the story of Jules Verne is his first publication. For most of his adult life, Simmons had another occupation. I worked in advertising for, oh, almost 40 years and um, had an ad agency and a PR firm for 32 of those years. The inspiration for this book came from a dog who wandered into Simmons' life. I was looking for this trained pedigree dog and my wife, uh, where we kept our, our children's horses, um, there was a stray dog that came uh, there and the old man that, that ran the, the stable told somebody he was going to shoot the dog if he didn't get out of there. And so, anyway, my wife brought him to me, and I didn't want the dog, really, you know, and, and it's, you know, in the book, but, but I gave him a try, and um, he was great, just absolutely great. Filled with beautiful illustrations, the story of Jules Verne is a warm tale of a man and his dog and the lessons they teach each other over a 10-year span. Mr. Simmons was kind enough to give me a signed copy of the book which I would recommend to all dog lovers and people who appreciate the outdoors. From All Square Books, this is Warren Phillips for Newswatch.